All right. I think we're as ready for tomorrow as we'll ever be. Might want to hit the sack sometime soon. I'll be going straight to bed. Mind you don't oversleep, Matthew. I wouldn't. Don't patronize me, damn it. Rex and I have some last-minute eyes to dot at the command center. We have to ensure things run smoothly in our absence. Titan's foot. More paperwork? Awesome. Can't wait. I'll help you. I'll gladly lend a hand as well, boss. Better for you to be on top form when you head out. Right. Then I guess we're going our separate ways for tonight. See you bright and early tomorrow. Kiddo. Cheers. I'm not kiddo. Ah, gotcha. Glimmer, I know. You need something from me? Someone who uh, asked you to deliver a message, or...? Thank you. Hmm? I, I never got a chance to thank you. What? For saving me, that is. Oh. It wasn't that big a deal. All in a day's work. Sorry for flipping out at you. Uh -huh. Spark you, how dare you? That was my first thought. But now I'm glad I'm here. Glad I can choose for myself. That right? Say. Hmm? Your scar, that recent? What's the story? Oh, this. Lost it in the fight with Alpha. And got sloppy and had to pay for it. <sighs> I'm sorry. It's got its downsides. But I kind of like it. This guy I really looked up to. And an eye thing, too. Like a mentor? Sounds nice. Hey, why do you do all this? Why do I do all... What now? All the helping. It's nothing to do with you. But you risk a life and limb. Fighting to protect people you don't even know. Smiles, I guess. Uh, smiles? If through my fighting, someone out there gets to smile, that's the kind of world I want to help create. And that's why you fight? Yeah. And also, you're a little off. It's not nothing to do with me. Huh. Long as you're alive, you're always connected to others. We used to call it affinity or bonds. Bonds? Our meeting was the work of chance. Chance. That's what tied the bond between you and me. And now, we gotta protect that. Well, Spark. Protecting the world, see? It's just that simple. Right, is that everyone? Um, we're missing Matthew. That's worrying. Has something happened? <sighs> Sorry, you guys. Sorry I'm late. I cannot believe you actually overslept. Yeah, I don't know what happened. Just couldn't settle down. I was tossing and turning like crazy. Oh, diddums. Gee, someone's got a sensitive constitution. Matthew, sensitive? You want to share your observations with the rest of the class, Nicole? Oh, no. Nothing to add at this point. I worry about the future sometimes. I'll move us right along, shall I? Let's talk about the route to Prison Island. You see that? Out the back of Colony 9? Is that a cave? That's right. That's the first waypoint. There's a large pit beyond the cave, 
which would be difficult to scale by hand. Fortunately... We've got the ether lift, right? One step ahead of you. As you say, it'll be perfect for a field test. Panacea, have you got what we spoke of? Yes, teacher, and not a moment too soon. Thanks for your hard work. Just what the ether lift needed. It's time to take Alpha down a notch and bring Nael home. For better or worse, it's nearly over. First, Prison Island, and then Origin. Strap in, everyone. It'll be the ride of a lifetime. Climbing up that. That's what the ether lifts for. Let's get it set up. We can see Prison Island from here. That's Snowy Mountain. It's like Capricorn Peak in the upper reaches of Etia. Yeah. Must be horribly cold there. I see it's not just Valak Mountain. Some of all rest, too. Yeah. Going by the Tantalese ruins there, it must have got fused with Gembu's interior, too. I would hate to get stranded in a place like that. A most uncommon item. I cannot believe you. That day was the first time the two of you ever met, and you just assumed A was from the city? There was a lot of us. I didn't know every single person. A had supposedly lived there and just happened to be coming back. That's basically when our paths crossed. So you knew nothing at all about A, but you tagged along anyway. Ugh, nobody's that oblivious. Hey, blame the one keeping the secrets, not me. You never thought to inquire about it, so I never told. That's all. Huh? Don't give me that. I mean, traveling this world alone isn't exactly normal behavior. Normally, we'd inquire. No, you wouldn't, normally. I'm free. 
freezing my balls off. Can't get a good foothold. This seriously sucks. You can get used to anything, kiddo. Come on, lift them knees. Agnes Castle. You still think about going back, Glimmer? Ugh, dude. Can you stop with the pitying look? Please and thank you. I was just remembering. That's it, I swear. But, I mean, you were close to homecoming. Ugh, I'd be lying if I said I was over it completely. But I don't want to run away from this. At least, not anymore. Being around you guys is full of frustrations, not to mention surprises. I don't have the time to wish I was elsewhere. Um, which emotion is that again? Are you feeling angry? <sighs> Nicole, you really need to work on your conversational skills. Huh? Over there, you're calling that landmass the Orion Mountains these days? Yes, that's right, I think. Right, right. Mountains. Hmm? You want to say something? No, just reminiscing a bit. One time I got swallowed up by them. That was one hell of a ride. Huh? Damn, Rex! You're good! You almost had me there for a sec. Oh, a joke. I get it. Hey, are you feeling okay? Your head, specifically? Hey, lay off me. I guess it does kind of sound like a fever dream. response be? Hey. Go on. When I turned down the chance to be a god, I lost the power to have visions. But you, eh? There is no single established future. You should know that better than anyone, Shulk. <laughs> if I were to tell you now what form your futures might one day take, it would be but one possibility, and a hazy one at that. The thing that gives shape to the future, it is your will. That's all the future is. Shulk. <laughs> You're quite right. I don't relish getting old. Age saps my courage. That's perfectly correct. Leaping blade first into thick of fray is game best left to young and reckless. You said it, Riku. Actually, is Masterpon who say. Your master, eh? Masterpon say, when fine ones such give this. Isn't that... Everyone, 
is right here. And also with Shulk, there. You're right. We're not alone. Hmm. Well, best not look down. Say, hey, I'm not sure how much I should trust you right now. So talk to me. What really happened back then? In the city? If you're a part of Alpha, then you must have seen it, right? What do you know? I won't tell you. Why not? That's... Something I'm afraid you'll have to ask N about directly. I should. Then you must judge for yourself. What to do afterwards. Whom it is that you should save. <sighs> Beyond the answers you seek, you'll find Nell. Uh -huh. <sighs> is, uh... Hmm? Is A your real name? It has the nuance of the one at the beginning. In this world, only I and Alpha can claim that honor. <laughs> hey, these are rare. Nothing like a bit of DIY. Going up! Ah, there it is. So the inside of Prison Island looks like some kind of ruin as well, huh? It's a really unpleasant place. Well, for a place called something like Prison Island, it's at least pretty damn spacious, isn't it? Wonder what it was meant to imprison. <sighs> and it's got those monsters, shrouded in black fog. Those are fog beasts, signs of the strained world the black fog birth, and now servants of Alpha. But originally, something that had no place existing. I don't want to stay here longer than I need to. I can't say I'm not intrigued. Total no mark battle. Don't make me laugh. You're kidding, right? You want to fight that? Yeah. Mighty strike! Double bidding it! Double bidding it! Strike on the money! I expect no less from you, Rex! Double bidding it! Anchor shot! Leave the event. I'll be Whatever you need. 
something here we'll have this up in no time Whee! sweet What do you reckon it is? It's the first time I've ever seen Origin. But it feels like I've already known it forever. You know, it might not be just your imagination. Huh? What do you mean, eh? The blade you wield. There is a very special metal embedded within it. And that metal is a shard of Origin. What? Are you sure? But Grandad gave me this. Ever since you took up that blade, your fate has been inextricably entwined with Origin. <sighs> and now, finally, you stand at its threshold. This is the time to unlock your destiny. Reach out and seize the future you desire, Matthew. Yeah. I'm gonna. We have to keep living in this world. And for that, Alpha's got to go. You'll have my help as well. It is for the sake of this moment that I've traveled with you thus far. Thank you, A. It might not be the best way to put this, but it's like old times. In the past, you embarked for Ontos's memory space from here. Recreating it was deliberate on Alpha's part. You mean, we'll be able to board the Ark from here? Logically, it would follow, yes. Hmm. That's in! So he decided to work for us after all. What a considerate lad. <sighs> what is it? I've never seen a console like that before. I guess that's because he's one of ours. I know that. It's the look in his eyes. Did you see? What? The other consoles. In theirs, there's joy. This gleeful glint. 
But for him, his hold no light at all. <sighs> I don't like it. Not one bit. Hmm. You trying to bar our way? That's the vibe I'm getting here. You're aware. Alpha said he was waiting for you. Yeah, and so what? What that implies is that he requires your presence. That without you, the Ark will not depart. Come on, stop beating around the bush, damn it. It's pissing me off. I'm saying the one keeping Nael in this world is you and none other. And that's why you're trying to kill Matthew, is that it? No thought for saving Nael or anything. Man. Twisted little so-and-so. You serious about this? I did warn you. Oh, gee, thanks. In the current of the eternal flow, you need not justify the means. All is swallowed up. Everything. Ugh. Come then. This is where your journey ends. You damn fool! I'll end this right here, right now! Primal Chrono! This is ah! a... But how? That! No hold more! Shred the straw man! Everyone! I'm sorry! I'll try to get to you, okay? Blood moon! Gotta lie down for a second. I lost the enemy's attention! No hold more! This is the yeah. wrong thing! What's that? Strange pillar of light.
come. Enter the circle, quickly. It's just you and Matthew now. Now? What are you... Why are you doing this? But you told me yourself. You told me to make friends. Say something. He doesn't want us here. We're a nuisance. Nuisance? Right. You who've become Mobius. N. Isn't that your name? You. Who are you? What have you done to Nile? Its name is Alpha. An entity that wishes to erase this world. <sighs> He's wrong. I want to embark on a journey to the future. There's just the matter of unwanted baggage. What are you talking about? Lives. <sighs> we Mobius and every last soldier on the face of this world. I... what are... Th and that's why all this... See? We don't need them. I will... I will arrest it. This moment... this instant... Alpha! You will not seize this moment from me! How do you like it? Blood Moon! Right through! Chimera! I will erase you! Have it! How do you like it? Primal Kronos! You're just Mobius! But what's this power? You would never understand. This is my choice! So you choose to stay in the now, to abandon the future. The one leaving things behind is you! <laughs> Granda, help. Please help. Naya? It is done. Alpha. Leave her! <laughs> Niall is... She's your family. I can't let you do this. <laughs> what about Mum? Did she want this too? You don't need to know. The burden is... mine alone to bear. <sighs> Mum would... tell you to let it go, I'm sure. I know it. But you... you can't choose this path. Ondor. <laughs> Niall! Granddad! <sighs> this is the path I have chosen.
Matthew. Granddad! Take care of Nahel. The future. Granddad! It's in your hands. Matthew! Was that just now a memory from origin the clash between matthew and n afforded us a glimpse of it this is how n truly felt that's some history i can't imagine huh. the people who are of the city are the future of this world <sighs> and in alpha's eyes they are a crucial source of power. So you killed them all? Killed Grandad? It was Gondor's choice. I simply cut him down. As he desired. <laughs> Stop taking the piss! Grandad wouldn't... He'd never side with the likes of you! The future's in my hands! That can't be what he meant! <laughs> you don't even see it. Are you really that much of an idiot? <gasps> it's not just us, you know. It's your ass as well. It's all of that and more that he meant. And if you can't get that into your head, you're about the dumbest bastard there is. Matthew. Let's go. I don't have time for his idiocy. You're gonna leave him? He's Mobius. If he tries a stunt like that again, I'll just sock him another one. This was a family matter, through and through. End of story. Ah! What? El! Oh. I've been waiting, brother dear. Ah! Ah! 